Video transitions for editing are fire right now. In the past few years, developers of these transitions have really stepped up their game. So today I'm gonna to tell you what my five favorite Final Cut transition plugins are. My name's Jen Jager. I've owned a video production company for a very long time. If you wanna know what's hot in video, subscribe to my channel. So let's talk about these five amazing video transitions. I'm gonna to link to them all below. I don't have affiliate links or anything. These are just transitions that I think are amazing and that need to get more play in everyone's videos. So I judged these different transitions on a few different criteria customizability, ease of use, how broad the applications could be depending on the client, and of course price, because everyone cares about price. So my first transition I wanna show you is Trans Glass, and this is by Pixel Film Studios. Trans Glass is really easy to use, and it basically gives your transitions almost a look like your shots have like glass panes over them, but you can even change the tint of those glass panes so you can really customize the way they look. The package comes with so many different variations. They live in your transitions bin. You just drag and drop and then make adjustments if you see fit, but really these are kind of plug and play. They're so easy to use and they're only $29.95 so you can't beat that. I love this look because it really works with so many of my like more corporate clients. They're interesting but not too funky so I'm super into this one. My next favorite transitions plugin package is called Split Pop by Stupid Raisins. This one costs $59. And what I really love about it is that they are elegant split screen transitions that build in and out and can divide your screen into as many as nine different shots. These transitions use drop zones, which makes them super easy to use. And you can even customize like the width and color of the borders, so I love that. I even used this Chevron style transition in my company's demo reel for 2019 because I loved it so much. My next favorite transition pack has such a wow factor. It's called Transchroma. It is also from Pixel Film Studios. This one combines like everything that's hot in video right now. Color keying, masking, and then those really cool zoom blur transitions all in one. Check out how cool these shots look. Basically what you do is you key out certain colors in your frame that you personally select, and then you can even mask out objects so that the color isn't being pulled from everything in your shot. So you can leave some of that color in certain areas of your frame, and then you can decide where you want it to zoom to, and it reveals the next shot. It's amazing. It really is like, I haven't seen anything else like it and I love this transition. What I don't love about it so much is that it's a little complicated to use. I had to watch the tutorial video so many times to get the hang of it. You actually have to tell the inspector which step of the process you're on and then there's like extra funny little things about it like you have to click off the transition and then click back onto it to switch to the next step so to go from color keying to the masking to the zoom it's just a lot of extra clicking around i think they kind of had a little bit of a challenge like programming this one a little bit, but if you have the right client and the right shots, it's worth the effort. I'm a big fan of this one, and this one also is only $29.95. Another transition I really love is called Parallax and it's by Premium VFX Transitions. This is another one that I think is just super like classy and elegant looking, really works well for my corporate clients. What it does is it kind of distorts and prisms the frames and then does these really cool zoom moves in and out. And then additionally, if you look really close, it actually has a particle emitter. So you get these cute little particles throughout your transition. You can actually customize those particles uh, to change the color or how many or how opaque they are. So it doesn't have tons and tons of customization, but if you look in the bin, there's so many variations in parallax. So you can use this transition many times over within one video, but have each one have a little bit of a different look. So I think this is a great option. And this one is $59. 
My last pick for great transitions is called Trans Text Volume 2 by Pixel Film Studios. This one's $29.95 and it utilizes masking, which is a huge trend in video editing. Watch what happens here. You can have your text fly on the screen and then all of a sudden it masks to reveal the next clip in your timeline and then the text zooms way in and you like zoom into your next shot. It's really awesome. What I love about this one is that it includes all the fonts you already have. You can customize the size, color, position, so you could do a lot of tweaking in there. And it has a lot of different variations for how the text can fly in. Personally for me, some of these movements I'm not really crazy about. They're a little hokey, but that's kind of like the norm for text animations. Some of them are great and they're your kind of go-tos, they're very classic. Some of them are a little kitschy and you may never touch or maybe only use once or twice, but I really love this transition. I think it's it just kind of grabs everything that's cool right now in video and in a really practical way because you are utilizing text, which a lot of us use in our videos. So I just think it's a great transition. The thing about these transitions or almost any transitions that you can buy right now is that they're really gonna elevate the quality of the video that you're doing. They can take your video from ordinary to amazingly extraordinarily with just the click of a few buttons. So I definitely encourage you to try to incorporate more of these really cool effects in your videos. If you wanna know more about what's hot in terms of products, software, or to learn some stuff from some tutorials, make sure you subscribe to my channel. I post every Monday and I'll see you guys next time.